I've had a, uh, a parcel. So I thought I would uh, unbox it and see what it is. So, well, I know what it is. But it's, it's exciting when you get these through the door. So, oh, a note. Hello. Probably worth taking the lid off and checking everything is located okay, particularly the WE DFS board before switching on. Oh, okay. Thank you, Peter. I'll uh, keep that in mind. Here we go. So we have a BBC Micro. So there's the manual and straight away I've already made my money back because these are like gold dust and it's well and truly packed in there nicely as well look excellent now we'll move that to one side and uh, we will uh, give it an unpack See what we've got. Certainly, uh, wrapped it well. There we go. impressions one I can't unpack a box very well <laughs> there we go right it's uh, as you can see slightly yellow so we've got a, a light patch and then it's really dark everywhere else keyboards really yellowed but these are not too not too bothered because I've got a pristine version of um, the BBC this will be my fourth uh, I've got different uh, motherboard issues so I will take it apart and have a look see what we've got inside because the actual case itself except for the yellowing it looks looks okay right so there we go and we have an issue four don't think I've got an issue four. I've got an issue. I've got uh, two issue sevens, an issue three, and now an issue four. Um, got some dip switches down here. Cool. Um, it has what looks to be a floppy disk controller. Yeah, it's a floppy disk controller, and we've got WordWise and an DDF rock in there so it's a little bit dusty so what I'll do is um, I'll get a brush out earth myself and we'll just give it a quick once over with a brush try and make it a little bit a little bit uh, nicer now according to the guy who sold it He's fixed the power supply, so we shouldn't have any power supply issues. So, I will uh, switch the camera off for a minute, give it a bit of a clean, then we'll switch it on. So, I'll switch the camera back on so you can see what it looks like before I put the cover back on. 
and then we'll stick it on the telly. I'll be back in a mo. Right, get it a brush and all the dust has come out of the keyboard which is good just needs a bit of a, a, cl a wet cloth all over it right we'll put it back together and um, we'll see if uh, she put switches on And then hopefully we'll find out whether the power supply has been uh, fixed or not. Right then, I will plug it into the telly. See you in a minute. Right then, plug it into the telly. Just about to switch it on. Here we go. And there's the two beeps. And well, look at that. What a beaut. Let's uh, see what we got on board. So we've definitely got uh, a DFS, Space, Utils, Wordwise Plus. Ooh, I've got Wordwise. Oh, so what's this one then? Oh, segment menu, that's a new one. Ah, that's a new one. Anyway, yeah. Basically, I bought this to um, allow allow me to do um, do machine code programming on on here because we can do machine code programming on here in the basic compiler. So. Um, they're going to be a next set of videos I'm going to be doing once I've finished off with the Commodore ones because at the moment my Commodore is still copying this it's taking ages so I will see you on the next video I hope this was useful right talk to you in a bit bye